Some breaking news to update you on this afternoon regarding the COVID-19 vaccine supply in Polk County. The county health director has acknowledged that she overestimated the future supply of the Moderna vaccine, and now the county is having to shift its plans. Our political director, Dave Price, joins us this afternoon with exactly what's happening. Hi, Dave. Hi, Jody. The Polk County Health Director Helen Eddy acknowledged to Polk County Supervisors this morning that she had overestimated where the supply of Moderna vaccine would go in the weeks ahead. So she said she was looking at the allocation that came in in January and then expected that that could be the increase for the future. As it turned out, that did not happen. Back then, she made the decision to use doses that had been set aside for second doses for people. And instead of using it for second doses, she used them for first doses for other people. So that then left a shortfall when the vaccine supply did not increase. Also remember last week, you heard about the bad weather in the southern part of our country that further delayed the arrival of some of the vaccines to Iowa and other states across the country. So there was a gap there of 14,000 doses. So Helen Eddy today said what they will do is that they will now use the remaining Moderna supply to give the second doses to people who already had the first dose. So there'll be a pause of vaccinating people on the county's efforts with Moderna if you haven't had it before. Now they still have a Pfizer supply. They will use a thousand doses of that to vaccinate seniors 65 and older who had already signed up. These are primarily people who don't have computer access at home where they can sign up so they use the call center. So they will focus those on the thousand doses to make sure those seniors get their first and second dose. And remember, this is only for the county health department's efforts here. So pharmacies and other outlets that are doing this they may not be affected by all of this. Now, Helen Eddy today said that it'll probably take till April or so to catch back up on all of this. Now, as you know, throughout this whole effort, there has been the focus on the time frame. So with Moderna, the CDC originally recommended that you get your first dose and then 28 days later, get your second dose. Recently, they said that research has found that you can wait as much as 42 days. So try to get that second dose within 42 days. At this point, the county health department cannot say that they can get everybody vaccinated in time within that 42 day time frame, but they are trying to do that. Now, the CDC has not expressed any concerns that if you should happen to get it on the 43rd day or 44th day, 45th day, that this was all for nothing. You're not gonna have to start the series over. There may be limited research on this, but they are not warning people. The guidelines are to try to get it within those 42 days. That's what Polk County Health Jody is saying that the efforts will be right now as they try to work their way forward. Now, some of this information might seem scary to some folks out there, but Polk County Health leaders are urging people not to panic. Right, and if you think about it more that Big picture, this probably means that some people will just have to wait longer. So some people will have to wait a little longer to get that second dose realistically. Mm -hmm. They did overestimate where the supply would go and supply has been a problem in Polk County and all over the country, as mm -hmm. we know. But it's really just a delay here. So wait a little bit longer potentially for that second dose of Moderna. Now, some people may have to wait longer to get their first dose than what the organizers had really originally hoped here, but that has been kind of a continued theme all over where there's been far more demand than supply. Okay, Dave, we know that you will continue to follow this as the day goes on. Thank you for that update.